Welcome to Plastifab's Advantage Insulating Concrete Forming or ICF System Installation Video Series. This video focuses on how to build a three-story partition wall from the footings to the roof. As a prerequisite to viewing this video, it is recommended that you see the Advantage ICF System Installation Video 1. In the foundation section, we will highlight layout in first row, filler and steel placing reinforcement, second course and steel, setting the rest of the block, bracing with wood, top and special cuts, pouring and vibrating concrete, and dowels and taping. In the main floor section, we will highlight starting and continuing the project, beam pocket, and finishing off. In the second floor section, we will highlight continuing the project, top course cutting the top block at the roof, setting walls straight, an introduction to metal scaffolding, attaching the framed walls and rafters, and bulkheads, and STC and fire rating. Layout in first row. Okay, today we'll be working on a party wall. Uh, this party wall, the floor trusses run parallel with our wall. So what we have to do is make sure that our footing's clear, our dolls are sticking out. We're going to measure out our lines. We're going to snap our lines here so we can get started. We're going to lay out our horizontal steel and we'll be ready to roll. So uh, I'll get Sebastian to finish sweeping off the footing and uh, we're ready to go. Okay, our block in this situation is 11 and a quarter inches wide, so we have to go 5 and 5 eighths on each side of center line. To 11 and a quarter, we'll do that at each end of the wall here, snap our lines and start laying block. Okay, our next step here is to lay out our horizontal steel and determine how long a steel we need. Steel typically comes in 20 foot lengths, so we're going to lay one where the wall's actually going to be, and we'll just stay back a little bit from the end of the wall, and we'll do our next one, and do the same thing, maintaining a, an overlap of approximately 40 times the bar diameter. With this, this is 10 mil bar, so 40 times. It's going to put us around a 16 inch overlap. Then our last bar is going to go in, and obviously it's too long. So we just have to determine with our overlap how long this bar will be. So this bar is going to be approximately nine feet long. Now that the steel's cut to length, we'll just lay our steel out so it's in a decent position for us. In this case, we're eight courses high with our wall, so we're gonna lay seven lengths of steel in each location. Okay, now we're ready to lay our first course of block. What we'll do is lay it out, determine our optimum cutting lengths for each block. So we'll start that right now. Sebastian, you can just start laying blocks, start at that wall, we'll come this way. Yeah, just set them over and keep them tight. Yeah, you can put it in there. You just keep the block tight, or as tight as we can. 